Yo, what's good? We're here in Toronto, my hometown. I just got back in from Paris. I found out that I have a billboard in Young and Dundas Square, so I had to pop up with the family to take that. I'll take a look at that. Uh, but first, let's get into what we got over here. Of course, my, my parents bought this Nature Valley with my face on it. Shout out to GM, General Mills, for their partnership. So if these are still in stores, go ahead and get you one. But this is not what's important right now. You guys want to take a look at this okay first off shout out to nike another one of my sponsors they gave all the medal winners at the paris olympic games this special custom briefcase to carry around our medal which is very nice because these medals are heavy so let's pop this open take a look and voila there she is so first off if you didn't know Winning isn't ever for everyone. <laughs> Nike let everybody know that. And then, got this little certificate in here. Visible tech, all the cool little Nike stuff that they do behind the scenes with the waffle and whatnot. You know, Nike, the visionaries they are. And then, you know, a little letter from Tinker, Tinker Hatfield. If you don't know who that is, if you're not a sneakerhead, he's the one that made the Jordan models that everyone goes crazy for. So shout out to Tinker. All right. So this is actually a piece of the Eiffel Tower that they put in all the medals in Paris. And you got right here, athletic athleticism, relay, four by one, home. That's French for how I don't speak it. But that right there engraved. And then of course, got the Victory Angel or whoever she is that's on all the Olympic medals. And then Greece and Paris. So. One more thing about these shoes, these Nike shoes, it's a Toronto collab. So you take this off, West End, take this off, East End. And then on the back, I don't know if you can see that, but you got the CN Tower and then these light up. You know, it's a little homage to Toronto. They got this whole idea behind it. And uh, the box has a lot of Toronto themes and stuff like that, but I thought it was pretty fitting to wear these in my city with my gold medal, you know. Pay back to the city, the six. Six side, man. That's where I grew up. It's unreal, man. <laughs> wow. It hits home like what this actually all means on the big screen. That's just, I never, I never dreamed of that, you know? Memorializing my own city, it's crazy. So, I look pretty good up there, huh? It's not bad, not bad at all. Honestly though, um, I don't really have the words, you know? It's like a dream come true. It's something that we always dream of having, but you never really expect it to happen. And uh, I just gotta give a big shout out to my sponsor Nike for making it, make this moment special. You know, um, immortalizing it for me. I'm never gonna forget that I was up in my own city on the big screen and um, makes me wanna work harder and achieve more special golden moments for Canada. So we can just keep celebrating the moment, ride the wave, you know? But to be here with my family, 
you know, allow, allow them to enjoy this too and give my kids something to look up to when they get older and just interact with the local Toronto, Torontonians. It's just great, it's for all of us, man. This is a special moment and it's, this kind of is the icing on the cake, so I'm grateful. Depending on where I'm at, you know, especially at track meets, I'll get attention when I'm in Canada, but not like this. Um, it, this takes it to a whole new level where people like legit know my face, they know exactly what I did, they know the moment and they were there cheering it on. And it just happens, so it's still in their memories, it's still etched in their brains. Um, but yeah, a lot of them are proud, a lot of them are thanking me for delivering this moment for Canada. They are cheering me on and it just makes me feel great. You know, it makes me feel good inside. You know, I feel a proud Canadian. That's what the Olympics are all about. It was definitely a core memory for me. I uh, so proud of him and it was an amazing moment for our family and for Canada and I just, I love seeing him get that medal and I love that the guys won.